I am I really quickly okay just to measure and mark your face? Great, okay, so you still want to stop talking. I'm going to get the depth of your head. Mm -hmm. You have quite a big head, don't you? Wow, that's really, really impressive. I'm impressed. I'm going to get your chin, but I'm going to see how far it actually comes out. Mm. Okay. Okay. I'm just going to get the distance. Oh, your nose and your lips. Perfect. And can you give me like the biggest grin you can? Like Grinch grin. You know, really big. Okay, so I'm going to do that. And also up there, just connect those all together. Alright, can you raise your eyebrows? Lastly, I'm going to get your nose hairs, so just stay still. You didn't know? Um, don't worry about it. I mean, they're not that nice at all. They're not even like that. You're fine. It's fine. All the way down there. Thank you. I am so sorry. I hope this doesn't come across as strange, but um, I couldn't help stare at your, your arms and your hands and you have the longest, fattest sausage fingers I've ever seen in my life. I was wondering whether you might let me measure them. <laughs> they are quite, they're quite chunky. I mean, they're quite long, chunky boys. So sausage fingers, like big, fat, fat sausages. Can I, can I measure them? Just for personal use. Nothing weird. <laughs> Can you stop crying and give me an answer, please? I mean, you must have known. Little sausages. They belong in a frying pan. Can I measure them? Thank you. It won't take long. Oh, wow. They're longer than I thought. Wow. I mean, even your thumb's really long. Just gonna get the width. Wow. They are really thick. Sausages. Five little sausages sizzling in a pan. Wow. <laughs> I'm gonna remember this day for such a long time. I'm gonna call you Sausage Finger Stranger. Hi, hello. Would you mind if I just really quickly measure and mark your face? No, perfect, okay. Stay still. I'd like to start between your eyes. Okay. Perfect. And I'm actually going to get your eyebrows as well. Okay. And I'm going to get your really long nose. Yep. Just as I thought. Really long. And I'm going to quickly get your mouth. And can you smile? Perfect. And I'm going to get your neck because I'm really curious about the length of your neck. I mean, you've got a bit of a giraffe neck going on. Can you reach tall trees and eat leaves from the trees? No? Oh, okay. Maybe you should practice because I think your neck has potential for that. Perfect. Okay. Now I'm just going to get your big foot. Did I say big forehead? No, I meant big, really average size forehead. Okay, no, I lied. It is, it is actually really big, and the tape measure does not lie. Um, how do you find hats that fit you easily, or you don't really wear them? Or maybe, maybe you should start. Okay, perfect. Good to go. Can I ask you a question? Oh, it's um... C 
can I measure your huge forehead? You must have known. You must. You must have known. Like, it's. It's unbelievably big. That's why I've got the tape measure. You know, I can measure in it, and we'll see. We'll see the measurements. They won't lie. Stay still. <laughs> yeah, it's. I'm not gonna lie. It's quite big. Let me get the depth as well. Wow. Does it? Do you ever get things like drawn to it, like as if it's got its own gravitational pull? If you get me, you know. Wow. And um. You've never had any issues fitting through doors? No. Wow. That's surprising. And uh, how do you do when it comes to hats? They rip. Oh, well, surely that should have been a sign. My god. And uh, do you get many thoughts? I feel like the logic of having a big head is a big brain, which means loads of thoughts. Do you think a lot? Do you say you're a thinker? You know, have lots of thoughts for good or evil. Are you evil? No. Don't know if I believe that. Your forehead's so big it's full of secrets. Hi, I don't suppose you have a spare couple of minutes just for me to measure parts of you and take some markings? Perfect, okay. I thought I'd actually start with your arms because they are wonderfully long. Wow. Can you reach really tall things on on shelves with your long orangutan arms? Yeah. That's incredible. Can you get the other one? Oh. Okay, this one's actually significantly short. Oh, did you know that? Yeah? Okay. So use the other one to get things off shelves. Yeah, I get it. Just gonna get you some. Mm hmm. And can you just scrunch up your nose for me? Okay, I'm just going to connect that up there and shade that in as well. Okay, I'm going to get your neck. Oh, you have an extremely long neck, my god. Um, do you by chance enjoy uh, biting leaves off of trees? Sorry. <laughs> I made a joke saying that you were like a giraffe because giraffes have long necks and you've got a long neck. But I'm just going to mark that there. Okay, I'm going to get your ears, just that part there. Okay. I'm going to get your earlobe as well, actually. Ooh. Has anyone ever told you I have saggy earlobes? Really saggy earlobes. I mean, I stretch my ears and your earlobes are saggier than mine, I'll tell you. This one looks a little, a little bit like a sunken piece of piece of dough. Oh my God, no one's had anything ever. No, well, I guess now you know. Yeah, and just lastly, um, I've noticed there is an excess buildup of hair coming out of your ears, so I'm going to just measure the ear hair as well. Yeah, that is. Embarrassingly long. Um, I'm surprised you can even hear at all. Can you? Like, do you find things quite quiet? Or yeah. Oh, okay. Um, I recommend possibly getting rid of them because they are quite disgusting. But I've got everything I need. <laughs>